Hi guys, Warner 2010 here, and welcome to my first room staying in the first room challenge on Shangri-La. Um, never done this before, so this should be fun. And can't see myself getting very far, really. Uh, maybe maybe round six. <laughs> I don't know what's good for this challenge, so basically I'm just going to go for a very low round. I'll say round five is my target. The Shriekers and Napalm start appearing on that round 5, and they are horrible. Um, so that will be my target, and then anything past that I'll be happy with. Um, so, as a... Oh, God, I thought it was instant for some reason. <laughs> Boy. Um, as always, thank you all for choosing to watch our video, and for subscribing to us, and supporting us, because we can't do anything without you guys. You guys are awesome. And you keep us running along. Um, so, what was I going to talk about first of all? Moon. I'm going to talk about moon. Moon, 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 moon. Um, my approval is definitely there. I think the thing I'm looking forward to most about moon is the zero gravity jumping. Where you like jump and then like slow mo fall to the ground. That probably just be the funnest thing we'll do. We'll probably spend the whole of round one. Just flying around, going wee, jump, jump, jump. But I do do that everywhere, anywhere. Um, but that that would be awesome. Um, what else can I talk about? Teleport into Area 51. I've got a couple of theories about that. Um, it'll either be part of the Easter egg or it'll be a regular game um, feature. That's not really a theory. That's just a comment. Um, but my theory is, we've only seen gas crawlers in like the trailer thing, they're only indoors. So, maybe the gas crawlers only appear at Area 51, and they don't appear on the moon? Maybe? That's kind of like... That'd be cool if that was the case. Oh, I'll just explain to you guys what I'm doing right now. I'm, I'm just bringing these zombies right around here, so just in case one of them drops a max ammo, so um, I've got the most time possible to change it into a perk. But none of them did. There's still more over there. The one? Oh, you do that. Um, so I do this every time to try and get a free perk, and hopefully Juggernaut can have a good time. But I never really have much time anyway, because they take it, and they run around there, and by the time I've realised that the perk bottle's about to appear, they're right on the steps, so I could mess up, effectively. Hoping not. Hoping I can get a free perk, and hopefully it'll be Juggernaut. Zombies finally around here. Oh, I'm shooting now. Wait for it. Wait for it. And go. He didn't even drop a per hour up. That's about right. Shangri La, in the first three rounds, you will get a max ammo if you're letting zombies in like I have. And that's a fact. I haven't not got one yet. Why didn't the grenade fall down there? That's weird. That was just a test. I was just doing that because I could. Not for any significance, really. Um, so, yeah, Moon and the four restored World at War maps will be epic. Of course, a lot of you have already got a lot. Some people have already got them. Um, some lucky, lucky people out there. Um, but most of us don't, and it'll be amazing when we do get them. I think I'm going to decide... There's my max ammo, like I said. Um, I think I'm going to do a high round attempt on every map when we get the restored version. I think he's going this way. Oh, I don't know when the... Oh, I'm not going to be able to get a free perk here. Oh, it's after the max ammo. I screwed that up. No. Oh, wow. <laughs> Usually what I do is I let the power run through once completely. So I can see when the um, perk bottle is about to appear. And then I try and grab it. But that definitely failed. So I screwed that up. Um, <laughs> could have used Juggernaut, really. But obviously I'm a failure. Um, <laughs> carrying on about Moon. Uh, the Easter egg end it all is that's what the achievement is, I think. As far as I know, unless that's just like a rumor. Uh, that kind of like puts the seal on Black Ops Zombies. Hopefully it'll be returning in the next uh, Treyarch and Activision game, but you never know, but as, as successful as it's been, 
that's made Modern Warfare 3 make a survival mode, which is basically zombies. It's kind of like damning evidence that they have to bring it back in the next one. Oh, I'm surrounded. Oh, Shrieker, Shriekers appear on round 4, I didn't know that then. Um, okay. That just makes my life even more difficult. Let's buy this thing. I never buy this. If, oh, God! Oh. Can't see a flipping thing. Is that a zombie? <laughs> oh, I'm just shooting nothing there. Get out! Oh, I hate this thing. Did I kill it? Oh, I killed it. Awesome. Right, um... Yeah, I'm just gonna grab that. Monkey can stuff it in his face. Anyway, um... I still haven't done another attempt on Shangri-La since my attempt I did quite a while back, actually. Uh, how long ago was it now? A few weeks. No. A good week. <laughs> week, that's probably less. Um, a good week ago. And. Oh no. I got to around 28 on solo and 31 on co op with Seraphim016. Who's one of our subscribers or here on YouTube. And I kind of like haven't wanted to do another high round attempt after that because it took so damn long. And we went through all of the hassle of getting the 31 to 79 JDB215 and it flipping made on zombie. Oh god, I didn't know it would hit me. Flipping hell. Right, that's annoying. Just gotta spam these everywhere so I don't go down again. Sugar. I swear to god, if you down me, I will have to kill you. Don't walk into a wall now. Um, so yes, yeah, it's pretty much the round I expected myself to get to. What's the double points? Don't need that. You can take that, monkey. Don't have no fight. Okay, so... My tactic for this has just been awful. It's basically just been wander around, hopefully, the whole time. It's probably easier. It is easier to play. Buy some ammo for the M14, um, simply because you've got four windows to cover here, and they're basically getting in from everywhere. It did well to put them in the corners as well. That's what makes this so difficult. Ascension, the four windows are just spread out, and the room is massive. Like moon, the moon room looks massive on moon. That's a twin twister. So. In that case, it's like going to be quite easy to stay in the first room. I would have thought. <gasps> no! Why would you down me? I <laughs> oh damn it! Was it the monkey that downed me? Bet it was. Shouldn't be any zombies. Damn it! That's my last quick revive, and they're uh, still spawning. Oh, God. It's so long to reload this thing as well. Not really time to aim down the sights on this turn. Thought there was. Then I realised there wasn't, so I just gave up. Uh, as with all of our challenges, you're more than welcome to attempt them. If you want to, you can stick your attempts in the video response, and we shall accept them, and they'll be on the video. And if you beat us, we'll credit you with uh, whoever you are, beat us. With a record of this round, this many points, or whatever we're gonna do. So, yeah, if I get a good amount of points in this challenge, which I don't think I would have done, then I'll post that as well as a challenge to beat how many points I got. But I'm pretty sure that I barely got any points. I just mowed down the rest of those in one click. Alright, um. <laughs> why the hell not? Why am I? One thing I do want to quickly test before the zombie starts spawning. That doesn't work. <laughs> oh, we got a runner. Right, so I could probably get through half of this round. Oh, round seven. Put it in round six. But not much further than that. Ah! Uh, um, 
Because when I down, I can fire my Mustang and Sally's. Sugar, nice timing, mate, Barn Zombie. Oh, flipping hell. It's just burn all my zombies. I love you, mate, Barn Zombie. I don't now. Could, what, what just hit me? The fire? Must have been the fire. Oh, okay. Well, that fire actually took out quite a lot. Well, it's not over yet, though. Oops. Screw away. I think the round's getting to an end. Oh, completely forgot what I was doing there. Oh, I can't find the cook of ice. Well, I've got to round eight then, unless I screw up here. Oh, Max Ammo, right. I'm just going to assume they're going to change it straight into a perk bottle, so I'll just shoot it at the moment it changes it. Flip. <laughs> I really thought I could do that then. Unfortunately, I can't hold on to that. When the monkey's about to take it, I'll grab it. Oh, no, now I'll do. Let's try and stay alive for as long as possible, really. Which won't be much longer. But hopefully this time a napalm zombie won't spawn on top of me. No, we got a shrieker instead. In some ways that's even worse. Wow, I hit one zombie with that grenade. Ah! Run into a wall, what a great way to go. Well, I've survived eight rounds. Um, uh, eleven thousand three hundred points. That wasn't very good, was it? Um, yeah, you want to beat that? You can more than welcome to give it a go. I just wish I would have got a free perk. That would have helped a hell of a lot. But thanks for watching, as always, guys, and goodbye.